She always had a smile and she always gave you a hug. She was an angel on earth. Now she's an angel in heaven. She is the first one you see in the family that has a big smile and a welcoming, hello, who are you? So she definitely helps bring us together. We know she's gone, but you walk in the house and you just are waiting for that hug. I can't figure out how she balanced everything in her life um, to accomplish everything that she did. Christina, she was in there drilling holes, pulling electrical wire, she tile. I mean, she pretty much everything she could do, she, she did. She wanted people to know how much they were valued and loved. I don't think it was taught. I don't think it was learned. I think it's just Christina. Right. She taught grades here. The school is all one school, so she taught every grade. And from kindergarten up to seniors, she was loved. She didn't live a life that she could regret. She's just loved. Christina was killed by a negligent DUI driver on Idaho 55 north of Eagle. She was known to lead others by example, by her bright smile and kindness. She is survived by her husband, Chris Rowley, her three children, Megan, Carson, and Hannah. We'd like to reach out to all the law enforcement folks to help support a brother in any way they can. The Christina Rowley Memorial Fund, organized by Michael Rowley. Visit the following address to support the family. <laughs>